how to trim a parrot's claws, um, which we call talons because they're big and when they're sharp, man. Stay, stay. The first thing is you really want to have the right tools. So we have a Dremel that we just got on Amazon to um, file down a cat or dog's claws and just people nail clippers like for toenails and they both work. So we're going to have Shalha hold Ketsy. Wait, don't go anywhere. And you need a towel and you have to come sit over here so that Okay, now another important thing is how we hold a, a parrot. Um, you could see that, well, I'll, I'm gonna go over that with you in a second. Um, I'm just gonna trim the very tips because just like my nails, where my the pink of my bed can bleed and that's not really what we wanna trim. The same is true with a parrot. They do sell something in case you cut too much and it really does the pink but um i don't believe in trimming that much so we just try to trim just the ends now you could see how easy it is especially with a tool like that i'm going to show you the dremel just so you have an idea it's really nice it just files down and with a bigger parrot it lets you um kind of go around and soften so you don't have you're not left with a sharp angle and um and you can kind of get everything the nice the other nice thing about the dremel is if it touches their skin it's not a problem or your skin it's touching my skin right now no problem now we could do the same and we can come in here hold his beak down and try to shape this long beak a little give him a little trim you could do it with the lower mandible as well oh cat it's okay it doesn't hurt them it's like a nail but either it scares them or they just don't like it because that's their tool that's their how they experience the world okay so you can see that with two people that was pretty easy i want to point out Shalha's fingers are on Ketsi's cheeks. Ketsi cannot bite her, and she's holding him in place. Also, Ketsi's throat and chest are completely free, so it doesn't bother his breathing at all whatsoever. She's holding him very safely and very securely for both of them. Super duper important. You can do this by yourself. Um, it's tricky. You kind of have to like hold like that, and then somehow or another pull your fingers up it's it's tricky but it can be done with a towel it's a little easier um thanks for joining us if you love learning about parrots and taking wonderful care of your parrots uh be sure to join or subscribe to our youtube channel and please share in the next video we'll talk about wings and trimming wings safely for your parrot oh sorry thanks for being such a trooper Ketsy. thanks see you next time